Okay, so I got ahead of myself and wanted to finish the book. So what I did was I made sure this was dry and it's fine. Then I took some jelly print. It's a very faintly turquoisey color, which is what the most of this book is. And um, I cut the paper here. You saw me sew the signatures in, so what I'm going to do now... Let's see if I, this thing will work. It's for the whole bunch of PVA. Of course not. hi yay yay <laughs> Okay. I'm going to put a bunch of PVA here. Now oh, this little teeny squeezy bottle. And I'm going to put this in here. Hopefully I have it centered enough, well enough that it'll close, close. And there we go. I need to kind of press it down in between, in between everything and make sure that it'll stick. The bone folder's too big to go in here, so I'm just gonna use the um, pokey tool. I just want to kind of mash down on it a little bit in between the signatures to make sure that the glue is sticking because there is texture under there from the uh, waxed linen thread that I used. She has a beautiful book. She's done beautiful work and I don't want to mess it up for her. Let's see, that's I don't want any glue in there. And yes, it still has alligator mouth. <laughs> I can't I can't change it. I tried hard to. <laughs> Doggone it. <laughs> I thought I might be able to fix that for her, but I don't think so. And I know it's gonna get worse because as you can see the last signature doesn't have anything in it yet. Uh so <laughs> I know that she's going to put more stuff in it and it's going to be like bang. So I got some elastic from, uh, actually, I have some elastic over here in my drawer, in my supply kit. And what I might do is, oh, that one's got a knot in it. I can't use that one. But I might, if I can find a piece long enough I can use, I might dye the, the um, elastic and tie a bow in it so that when she's finished, the, the bow will contain all the goodness inside the book. I don't know how, I, I don't want to use Sorry Ribbon. I just, everybody's using it for everything and I don't really want to use it. So I think what I might do is I might try to dye this. I'll have to do it tonight to see if it's going to work. If not, she'll have to figure it out. So I'm going to take this and see if I have teal ink. Ooh, I do. I might, well... Yeah, I think what I might do is dye it and then I can tie it around here and then she can do whatever she wants on here. There's plenty of space to do up more stuff on the spine of the book. Yeah, I think that's what I might do is I might dye this overnight and um, try to get it. Otherwise, I have some, some gold. I think I have gold. Do I have gold? I don't know if there's enough of it. Oh, I do. I think I might have enough to tie this in a knot. I think it might look nicer if the stuff was the same color as the book because we would know that it's specific to that book. So let's try that. All right, so I'm going to dye it overnight. Whenever I get finished and I think it looks lovely, I'll come back on it. Maybe I'll just do photos. That way this video is done. <laughs> okay, so I hope she doesn't mind me showing her book. I don't know who it's going to. I didn't really look in a lot of the stuff. I just see that it's just lovely. 
just lovely. Wow, I need a gift like that. <laughs> anyway, so there's the book. I fixed it, and now it's still got alligator mouth. And I don't think I'm going to ever stop it from having that, but at least it's not as bad as it was, and it's a book book. Okay, so that's it for me, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, everybody. Okay, so I decided I would show you how I do this. This is a sheet pan that I use for dyeing, and this time I got smart and I put on a pair of gloves. I know, write that down because it may never have it again. This elastic was too long, so I'm going to take the elastic. And because there was red on here and this, I don't know, it, it might come off, so I don't really want to encourage that. So I'm going to take this, and this is um, F.W. Delroney. Blot that on there and rub it around. Oh, that's a green. Oh my, no. That is not going to work. Well, phooey. Okay, so this is so not what I wanted. <laughs> Dadgummit. Well, now that I've gone and done it, might as well finish it, right? Okay, so let me spray it with a little bit of water. stinkers. <laughs> well, that'll make a lovely green. <laughs> okay. Good thing I did it on here instead of... Ugh. Okay. Okay, so now I have to come up with plan B. I don't know what that is. <gasps> okay. <laughs> you know what? I am not taking no for an answer. I'm not doing it. So, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to add. Ooh, is that a metallic? I don't like metallics. Pearl something. Uh, no, don't do pearls anything. I think that's what it says. No, what does it say? Promenades. No. I need a teal blue. Uh, what's this one? This one says Artist Ink. Okay, that's not helpful at all. What does this say? Same stuff. Okay. Well, phooey. What color is that? Okay. You know, for two cents. <laughs> ah. All right, so. Uh, wait. Here's some paint that looks tealy blue. We're going to use this. We're going to rectify. Oh, and there's stuff in it. Okay, you have to stay there. And we're going to flip this over. And you're going to sit right there. This is the one I cut in half, the other one. I'm going to spray some water on it so it doesn't... <laughs> what a mess. If I didn't have messes, what would I do with my time? Come on, spray. Stinker. Okay, I need a paper towel. And then I think I'm going to try to pull some of the cover. Wait, do I have a napkin in? Nope. Okay, let me get a paper towel. It's a very dark color. 
Don't touch it with your fingers, Vicky. There we go. Well, it's a tealy blue, turquoise-ish. Yeah, that'll do. All right, so I'm going to leave this here on my desk with a towel, paper towel on it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and then I'm going to just crawl in the hole and stay there till it dries. All right, guys, now this is the last of the video. Stay tuned for pictures at the end. Oh, God, I hope I have some. <laughs> Bye.